Yestreen I saw a strapping shield, who played the bagpipes and coveal. The blood get coursing through my veins, while listening to the stirring strains. I sat entranced and could not speak, ensconced beside the ingle cheek. The hours flew by on golden wing, while fancy, soaring, had her fling. He skilfully played with martial march, till voices answered fray each arch. Flooding through space, wild melody, in surging swell and pealing cry, the quick straspe was fingered wheel, but faster still each rousing reel, it fairly tipped me, fidging, fain free dancing, I could scarce refrain. Enchanted with the joyous sound, the feet kept leaping from the ground. Amazed, I watched the fingers slim, like lightning o'er the chanter's skin. Unseen, they danced from key to key, too fast for mortal eye to see. The crimson shade went down with joy, enraptured with his piper boy. Oblivious to all around, with bated breath, we all profound. While aerial spirits loudly sang the triumph of each Gaelic clan. I say them all as in a dream, resplendent dressed in tartan green. Attend that minstrel as he crowned young Jamie mid the vocal sound. While plaudits rent the listening air, he threw o'er him his youthful hair, the mantle of undying fame, and said, Be worthy of my name. There never was in Scotia fair a piper with thee to compare. Of Highland bards you now are king, or ministerly you reign supreme. I rub my in, yes, it was true, they slowly melt and fade free view. Unconsciously he plays away beneath the wreath of floral bays. Ah, Mackintosh, say young and clever, that happy night forget I'll never, till grisly death shall intervene. I will remain your dearest friend.